The second episode that I watched from the Twilight Zone was The Hitchhiker. This was an episode that, by the title, I thought would be interesting. Any story regarding a hitchhiker is going to draw in my attention. Why? Because it never normally has a happy ending. And this episode? Well, that's exactly the case. So before I jump into this review, make sure you go over to my Twitter, at BrainPilot underscore, to see what I get up to outside of YouTube. So without further ado, I'm BrainPilot, and here is a review on The Twilight Zone, The Hitchhiker. So it starts off with this woman that seems as though is having trouble with her car, and it's getting tended to by the repairman. He is unable to fix it and tells her that she has to follow him to the station where he is actually able to fix it. There is a quote early on at this point about her driving 65 down the road and that she's lucky to be alive. Also, there is another point where she has to pay out a small sum to the repairman for fixing the car, and she says how it's better than paying for a funeral. Just after this, I thought it was just the speech that I could just throw away. However, at this point you are introduced to the hitchhiker and only she is able to see him. This is when I started to think, is she actually alive or is she dead? Seeing as though nobody else noticed this person at all and as well, he would disappear straight away. Let's fast forward. She's driving along this endless road and she's constantly bumping into people and seeing this hitchhiker, although nobody at all can see him. This scares her to the point where she ends up in the middle of a train track being taunted by the man on the other side whilst the train is moving. At this point, I was unsure to whether or not she was going to make it off the tracks before the train hit her, but I didn't feel the tension, or the suspense of what might happen. I just didn't really care. Once she makes it off the train tracks, her car runs out of gas and she ends up going to a gas station at night. Whilst she's there, she meets a naval officer who keeps her company until she has another episode and tries to run over the hitchhiker. Just like everybody else, the officer doesn't see her and ends up leaving her on her own because he feared for his own life. In a panic, she finds a phone booth and phones her mother. This is when the big twist occurs. At this point, you find out that her mother is in hospital due to the fact that she's struggling to cope with the death of her daughter. It turns out that the woman that we have been following the whole time is actually dead, just as I thought at the start. She actually died in the accident that the repairman came to fix. I thought this was a very good twist, don't get me wrong. However, somewhat predictable. My main concern with it is who are all of the people that she spoke to along the way? Are they dead as well? That was the one confusing part for me and I just didn't really get it. As well, who was the hitchhiker? I'm taking it as though he was somebody that she killed in the accident, as his only line in the episode was something like, I believe we're going in the same direction, or something like that. And then the episode finished, with the view of the hitchhiker in the rearview mirror. I felt like the plot of the story was very good. It was strong, and most likely extremely original for back when it was released. However, I don't necessarily feel as though this one has stood the test of time. This is because we've seen story after story with a similar premise and we're just used to that now. The acting itself, it's stylistically suited to the era of when it was released, but it's charming to watch today. Overall, I feel as though this was a really interesting episode of The Twilight Zone and it did make a great watch. However, I feel as though the story was fairly predictable and failed to get all of the emotions out of me that it should have. I'd have loved to have watched this when it was originally released in the 1960s, but I wasn't there. And because of that, the episode doesn't hit quite as hard as it should. What did you think of the episode The Hitchhiker? Did you enjoy it? Leave a comment down below and don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you next time.